I have two main passions in my life. Trains, which you probably already knew about if you've watched my channel before, and rock music. I've always loved when the worlds of rock and roll and trains come together, which happens more often than you might think. One of the prime examples of this is Neil Young, the iconic Canadian-American songwriter behind hits such as Harvest Moon and Heart of Gold. With a combined total of over 136 million record sales across his career, Neil is a legend in the rock world. But what if I told you that Neil was also a legend in the train community, as he was at one time the owner of Lionel Trains. Much like selling millions of records, taking a train layout on tour with me is purely a dream as of right now, but Neil Young made both of those dreams a reality. Let's take a look at the O-scale layout that Neil Young took on tour. The year was 1997, and Neil Young was taking part in the Horizons of Rock Developing Everywhere, or Horde, tour headlining shows across the states with an all-star lineup of openers including other legendary acts like Primus. Neil's involvement with Lionel was arguably at its peak around this time, and Neil wanted to take a layout to the cities his tour was visiting to showcase the latest and greatest in Lionel's technology at the time, which would have been the introduction of the TMCC system, the predecessor to Legacy. Per an informational plaque at Entertainment Junction, this layout was built in San Carlos, California in a warehouse near the ranch Young lived at at the time. The factoid reads that over 50 people had lent their talents and creativity to the project and that a local hobby shop was on call and would deliver supplies within the hour when they were needed. Building a model train layout for Neil Young sounds like quite the dream job. I'll let the trains do the talking for a little bit now, so please enjoy a look at this very historic and one-of-a-kind O-Gage layout. 